Hi, this is Beata from Split Coast Dampers. In this video, I want to show you how to use the dryer te sheet technique to give your image a very soft and sparkly look. For my sample, I used Gina K stamps, the winter wings for the image, and sentiment, and behind this sentiment, the vintage borders to soften it up. To begin with, you'll need any image, color it, and if you color it, use bold colors so you can see it through the dryer sheet and then run your image through your siron or spray adhesive on top of your main image and then I'm using my scissors to just cut it in shape and it doesn't have to be exact but I don't like to have the sticky adhesive hanging off You will need the adhesive on top of your image. And you peel that off and adhere your used dryer sheet over it. Don't use a new one because it's too stiff. You need it to have loose woven fiber, fibers. So then just put that over it and then cut around the image again. Now you can leave it like this or if you, if you like glitter, if you like sparkles, what I'm going to show you in a second is you just apply fine glitter over your dryer sheet and because it's used and the fibers are really loosely woven now you can glitter will go through the dryer sheet now if I would do that um, if I would cut it not in the tutorial I would just use my nest abilities again and run it through my um, die cut machine. So now you just add glitter over it and rub it in. And tap the excess off and I don't know if you can see how fuzzy and cozy it looks. And then just use that image on a card to finish it off. I hope you try it out. It's fun and it's great for winter cards. See you next time!